Hi everyone, I'm Laura Newell and today I want to talk a little bit about liners for cloth diapers. Uh, we have had crazy problems with ammonia and diaper rash and all sorts of things and so I found that using liners with our diapers was very very helpful. So at first there's two options. There is reusable, washable um, fleece liners that you make yourself or you can probably buy them, I'm not actually sure. Uh, but this is just regular fleece that I just cut to fit inside her diapers. Um, you want to make sure that it's not the, I believe it's the anti-pill fleece. All fleece is kind of water resistant so if you drop water onto it it'll kind of just roll off. But um, regular fleece will kind of absorb it more than the, um, the really smooth kind that just water will just fly off. So <laughs> these work fairly well. Um, I, I can't say that I love them. I do love that they're washable, uh, so they're money saving in that matter, but uh, like I use coconut oil with them and the coconut oil does not wash out very well and so that's kind of attributed to our problems. So I kind of stopped using these and I don't use these for like really intense diaper cream because I would literally have to sit there and hand scrub it and that's just kind of gross. So. That is one option for liners, but I do, I have been using these when I use pre-folds and flats and overnight because she was getting uh, rashes and irritation from the natural fibers. So that is one option. The other option is using disposable liners. Um, you can buy flushable liners, which it's kind of iffy whether or not your, uh, <laughs> your toilet system can handle that or not. Um, even if they are flushable, a lot of people do say that throwing them out is a better option, but you know, that's that's between <laughs> you and your plumbing system. Um, these are the DIY version, and these are just Viva paper towels. Um, Viva, if you've never, I'd never even um, touched a Viva paper towels, but they're so soft, they're super, super soft. When I was thinking paper towels, I was like, oh my gosh, I got like Target brand and it's so rough. I would never put that on the bottom. But these are really, really soft and they say it's very similar to the um, texture of the flushable ones or the ones that you buy. So these, um, this was just the pack that they had at our Safeway and it was on sale. Um, so I, I don't honestly know like the price difference. It depends on where you get it from and how many and all that stuff. But these are the choose a sheet ones. So you can either just do one, uh, one little separation, which is pretty thin. And when I've been putting on real diaper cream, I've been doing two just to give a little extra strength. But, um, you know, it's up to you what you want to do. And there's quite a few on here, so it does last a decent while. It makes cleanup very easy. I personally love these. I think this is a really great way to go, and it's fairly inexpensive. Uh, you know, we were using, because she has a rash, and we were using diaper cream on my Use Mommy Potamus' recipe that I'll link below. And it technically, I think she says, is diaper cream, is um, cloth diaper safe, but it's so hard to get out. I'm not sitting there and scrubbing that out. So uh, that's why we were using the liners, but even those were hard. So then we just started using disposables. Uh, but disposables are expensive and I don't mind using them when we're out and about, but I'm sorry. I can't use them for a week at home just because we're using cream that gets way too expensive. I can buy all of these. You know, I got this whole six pack of um, towels for, they were on sale for $6.99. Way, way cheaper than a you know little pack of diapers this big that's thirteen ninety nine. So, yeah, um, I would much rather go this route. It's pennies instead of dollars. So, I do like these uh, very much. And then you know we just throw them out just like you would a disposable diaper. So those are the two options. You've got your reusable and your disposable liners. Price wise, you know. It depends on how much you get your fleece for and how much you pay for your paper towels. But I think that they are both very good options for different um, situations that you're dealing with. So that's my take on disposable versus washable liners for your club diapers. If you have experience with liners, share with me your favorite tips and tricks in the comments below. And we'll see you next time. Bye.